me my grapes, bitch. Grapes? Alright, try not to. Fucking waste of life. I said, eat the fucking, eat the fucking treats after we've recorded. Immediately opens unbelievably loud packet of grapes. Oh, you're a piece of shit. Anyway, fuck. Don't me. People will be upset. <laughs> the three people that watch this video now will be like, oh god, never coming back. Immediately unsubscribe. Oh. What are we on now? We're on boss the. We've done 13? Or 14? 13. It uh, came up on the low, low thing. 13 defeated. Right, okay. So. We're gonna have to start back thinking what we're gonna play next. Yeah. Oh god. But not while we're recording, because that'll ruin it. Yeah. <laughs> Um, by the way, yes. I went the Destiny Midnight Launch last yeah. night for the oh, Taken yeah. King. Yeah, you're a massive nerd, yeah, Bob. Mm-hmm. <laughs> for those, well, I was about to say, for those that can't see, so everyone, uh, Gibbo just turned to me with an absolutely withering glance there, and my soul felt cold for a moment, <laughs> if I indeed had one. Good. Continue. Yeah, so I went the midnight launch um, to a. I got you, fat bitch. Come here. To a certain retailer, oh, I'll say. Yes. Um, it was relatively disappointing, mate. Like I went to GameStop. <laughs> Go there now and enter code oh my UKD to get your eight percent off of Destiny: The Taken King. Fuck's sake. <clears throat> but yeah, I went uh, to the midnight launch that way <sighs> about five people were there it's not the same as it used to be for midnight launches mate honestly yeah. like there used to be fucking huge boxes where you used to get tons of crap dude you went to a destiny one no yeah. one gives a shit about destiny no because you can just buy it on fucking line yeah. which let me get to the crux of the story is I the best apologize. part okay <laughs> so I go to the counter I speak to the dude serving me who's, he looks like he's about to shit himself when he stares at me like I come to the counter, I'm like, "You're right, mate," and he's like, "Oh, oh, hello, oh, oh, oh I am un- Well, I was just about to say I am unbelievably socially awkward, but I am as well. So, yeah. So I, so I can actually say that you, you know, I can make fun of it. Well, well, I know where it's coming from, so it's fine. So the poor guy's stood there, all timid as fuck, and I'm like, "Right, can um, I've not pre-ordered anything, sorry, mate." Um, I just said the social equivalent of "I'm not racist, but." Carry. On. Anyway, <laughs> carry on. Fucking moving on. Yeah. Um, yeah, I basically just said, look, I've not pre-ordered, I've not done anything, yeah. I'm alright, I still have a copy of the, the Taken King. He was like, yeah, it's fine. Um, are you after just the Taken King, or do you want the Legendary Edition, which comes with the original and all the DLCs I and the Taken why. King? Go on. And I'm like, no, mate, I just want the Taken King. Yeah. Like, are you sure? Because you can't play the Taken King without the two first DLCs. I'm sure, mate, I've got them. Right. So you just want the Taken King? Yeah, I want the Taken King. Oh my King. god! Yeah. I want the Taken King. Please give me the Taken King. Yeah. Fuck. Finally serves me. Paid. All that shit. Great. Oh he hands me a receipt. Why? It's a fucking downloadable code. I thought I'd get a disc or something. With like yeah. a few bits and pieces. No. So, oh my god. Oh. Right. So you went all the way to the, to the store and got a code. Yeah. That you could have got online. I bought Nathan's copy for him as well. And he's sending me some money across for that. Um, okay. He got an actual disc for his. Brilliant. But the Legendary Edition requires, or is like the original game, the first two DLCs, and the Taken King. So I'm not surprised he got a disc, but I didn't. Mm. Sorted that. Get home. No, is it? I put the code in into the PlayStation Network. It's mm. fucking forty pound credit. Not the fucking game, just forty pound credit. Are you taking the piss? No. <laughs> they, so they gave you a gift card? Yeah. Not even that, they give you a gift card download. Yeah. So oh my god. It's set on the receipt, download, digital download for Destiny. It was like, right, okay, so I'm going to get an actual... Dude, I'm so fucking lost right now. Oh god. <laughs> Continue. Well, please. Please help. save the playthrough, Gibber. 
Yeah. Um, so yeah, I got home, I put the code in, and it's forty pound credit. I shit myself because I thought I'd done something wrong. Then realised it can't possibly be because it's forty quid, which is the exact cost of the Taken King. Yeah, it's not like thirty nine ninety nine. It's actually forty pound on the dot. Yeah. Um, so I put the code in, redeem the the credit. It's all well and good. I go to the page mm-hmm. on the PlayStation Network to get the Taken King. Download it, pay for it, all that shit, put my pre order in. It's not available for another four and a half hours. Why? Because it's going off the American time, I think. So I put the fucking. It's the internet! It doesn't need it! Oh! It's midnight launch for where the fucking. Store yeah, is, exactly! So it's like. It's the equivalent of you going to the store, be like, right, midnight launch, here we go, ground zeroes, let's get it. You go in there and you go, like, right, okay, here you go, here's your, here's your box. We need me box. We need the the game. No, the game will come out for another four hours in America. So you just get the box. <laughs> no, I will get the game. You penis. Yeah. So I got I stitched up twice. Then. Oh. I got. I'm not really asked because I still got it. It's just yeah, a waste. I know. But what's a fucking waste of time? What the mate? It's ev- it's so that is a microcosm of 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 why midnight launches are dying a slow death. Mm-hmm. Why would you bother? Why? I kind of wish I hadn't now. Yeah. Because then I wouldn't. You be didn't a- even get anything extra. It was literally a fucking gift code. That's the most upsetting shit I've ever in my life. I got, I got, I got a poster. Oh, the poster that you can probably buy online right now. Yeah. Um, I got a free poster. Oh god. And yeah. forty pound credit. Mm. It kind of pissed me off. I, I mean, I'm not arsed because I still got the game, and I'm pretty peeved that I didn't get to download it immediately. Yeah, that would have pissed me off. Like, it's done all the pre-downloading shit, but then the final download is to unlock all the Taken King content. Yeah. Um, so the game, the thing, the thing that you wanted. Yeah, basically. We've not been this way, have we? No, so not that I recognise. we're going the right way. Nagro does not like these pillars. He's like, his he's guidance AI is freaking out. <laughs> Come on, Agro. There we go. Yeah, um, mate. I'll be honest with you. If I was, if I went to that, oh my god, Agro, what? Get fine. I think this is it anyway. Um, if I, if I had gone to a midnight launch and they were like, "Yo, here's your discount code or here's your, here's your code for download. Go home and download it." No, absolutely not. I mean, there's not not a lot you can do. <laughs> you can go up. No, I want it now. I want it off the... Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah. You know some ultra arsehole's going to go back to the game and complain about that. Oh, yeah. Definitely. I fucking bought this game. I bought this game at 11.59 and I wanted to play it at midnight, hence why I went to the midnight launch. Therefore, I wish to have a full refund. And my dick blown. That's what no, but that's what that like, you, laugh, on top. you laugh though, but like that's what people do. Yeah. Like that's what like what the fuck? What the fuck? That, oh that, I know which boss this is. That feels out of place. Is this the Oh I think I know which which is is that myself. Um I just felt out of place as fuck for a sec. Um Yeah, it's this yeah yeah. I kinda like this one. Mm. And this is like the platforming one. Kind of, yeah. yeah. You've got to fucking... Don't ruin it. Yeah, fair enough. Um, but yeah. Yeah, there's people out there that are, that are like, um, yeah, I want... Because I've been inconvenienced 1%, I let you want... I want 100% of the everything back, and I want extra. I've got a new tactic for you as well. Oh, wait, no. You won't be able to do this, because... Right, don't, don't talk about work. No. But... Because it's not it's not good tact to be like, yeah, my job is this and it's shit and let's talk about shit about my job. No, but what I'm on about is when... So, <laughs> I did it the other day at work, basically. <laughs> this guy left a web note crying about something. Mm. Um, I'm warning you right now, this could backfire in your face if anyone finds out you've talked about your job on YouTube. Fuck it then. I'm just saying. Because if, if someone, if like your place found out you were talking about it 
on YouTube and you were bad mouthing a customer, it might end badly for you. No, I wasn't bad mouthing a customer. I was just going to say basically, he sent an email in. Well, just well, it, let's just let's just paraphrase. Is this is how you deal with a dickhead that ask, that's asking for this? It wasn't that though. If you let me fucking finish, well, I'm just saying. I don't want you to get in trouble, mate. That's he's a big scary dog thing. Whoa, that looks different. Basically, the dark soul creature. What I was I going to say is, yeah. he sent an e he sent an email in, and. <laughs> Whenever I open an order up, um, it brings the email up, mm. what they've said. So I started reading through the email and the guy was like, oh yeah, sorry man, I was in a pretty bad mood that night, so... And I made him feel bad, I think. <laughs> That's the point I was trying to get across. I made him feel bad because I was, I was reading out the web joke. So you like, appeal to his humanity, basically. I wasn't doing it on purpose, I was, it was literally the first call I'd had in the morning. Yeah, and I was reading out this email. And I was like, "Oh, uh, 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 how can I be compensated for this issue?" It was like, "Oh, yeah, sorry, man. I was I wasn't in a, a great mood last night, so I do apologise." I was like, "What? I what? didn't mean to make you feel bad. I was just reading the webinar out because I'm too tired to concentrate." You've sneaked me. Me? Therefore, no. Like the basic thing is you've sneaked me, so it's fine. Oh right. Oh god. For anyone, well, for people that are listening, sneep is a is a thing from where I'm from, from which is Stoke on Trent. Uh, it's basically sad, is what it means, but not too sad, but not like you're gonna fucking wreck my shit. This is where I'm supposed to be, right? Then he knocks us over. Yeah, yeah, that's it. You need to uh, like sort of aggravate him, him. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god, the fucking arrows. Come on, you prick! Bow! Not happy. Okay. Oh, here we go. Right, it's popping off. Have I just fallen off the side? I might just fall off the side. Am I underneath that? No, I'm fine. Maybe laptops having all kinds of fucking. Oh god, I was, I was pinching with tension what was going on on the laptop. I nearly forking. Forking? Well, I just walked off the edge right then, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, that jump you did then, he, he, he went at a 45 degree angle. <laughs> like, lunge oh. it. <laughs> Where is he? What have we done there? Shit. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's fucking throwing up all kinds of shit. Java updates, AVG needs to update, fucking Windows reset updates. Fucking AVG. It's really good, but oh my god, does it want it, want you to buy the Pro version? It really, really, mate, it really wants you to buy the Pro version. <laughs> also, I'm getting pretty sick of Windows being like, um, Windows 10's pretty good, you know. You've heard, have you heard of it? Windows 10 is the future? <laughs> have a look at that, mate. I don't want to because all my shit will not work anymore. No, but look at it though. Come on, we need the, we need the, come on, we need the data. I need to download and tell what's wrong with it. <laughs> huh? Uh, I didn't, I didn't. Oh god, I did not let go of that. Sniff, sniff. Oh, oh, come on. Oh god. He must have, like, you because know, there's obviously a building falling over it. Like, it's like, you're not allowed to hold on to that. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I didn't let go of the last one either. Oh my god, please. Mate, look at Wanda's hair. What about it? It's like pitch black now. It was supposed to be light brown. He was light brown before, you're right. I think we were talking about this in the other episode, weren't we? Like, how you progressively get through the game and you, yeah. you end up worse for wear. Yeah, it, it's... it's well, I mean, obviously games have done this before and they've been doing it for a long time, but there's, it never ceases to make me go, oh, oh, that's fucking cool. Yeah. When a game is set in almost, almost real time and it, like, you see physical... Like, I remember playing Arkham Asylum for the first time and how your cape gets fucked. Yeah. And, you know, and your, your arm gets stuff. chopped up. Yeah. When I first saw that, I was like, fuck, that's awesome. Yeah. But it's been going on for ages, but it's only at certain times you notice. Like, yeah. it's a really good game. Well, I'm zoomed in now, like... The, well, I thought you meant um, in this game in particular, but I, I know what you mean. I mean, yeah, you can oh. see his hair, all the fucking yeah. wounds he's got under his bandages. 
or trying to be clever and jump across to the thing as it was falling down. I'm, as uh, I've, it's been proven several times, I'm wank at this game, <laughs> so I couldn't do it. Uh, oh Christ! <laughs> oh God! Oh Jesus! I like this boss battle. I've inhaled about fifty grapes. <sighs> Yummy! Now I've got like trap wind or something. Mmm, delicious. No, it isn't. Delicious. Is it? Is it? Is it delicious, though? Is it? <laughs> it might be. It the grapes are delicious. Shut up. No, no, no. Oh, sweet Moses. I'm fine. <laughs> you literally walked through the pillar. I'm fine. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Oh God, Jesus Christ! Oh, hey, that was a cool fall. I was, I was falling like right next to the uh, the pillar, like a fucking anime. It's like one of my Japanese anime. <laughs> <laughs> How, mate? Spoiler alert for anyone playing. Um, Phantom Pain right now, but how far are you in Phantom Pain? Uh, mm. Have you met Emmerich yet? No. No, well, I won't say anything then. But it's a funny little thing, like a send up to the previous games, isn't it? Shit. I keep getting or going back to old games to play, like, for example, at the moment. Oh, God damn it. Um. I'm playing through Assassin's Man. Creed Black Flag. Yeah, I know you're playing that. Um, you big prick. Yeah. But before that, I bashed through uh, Force Unleashed 2. Mm. But I keep wanting to go back to the Phantom Pain, Ooh. but I've got so many other fucking games to complete. Then at work, I've just started playing through fucking um, The Last Remnant. Yeah. Which is a Square Enix RPG game. Yeah. The, the, the thing about that one out of all the other RPGs that they've fucking done mm. is that this one you control like a legion like a small army rather than just like individual characters oh right okay so you get groups and then oh god you get groups or what and you just fight again it's basically like turn based right. but you don't get specific commands you just like you tell them to either attack physically Attack with magic. Yeah. Um, they play it by ear. It's called as well, which is where you let them do their own thing. Oh. Or they can use. Oh, oh Jesus. God, that's happened like every single time on one of these. But it's, it's kind of cool. You basically control a small army, mm -hmm. and that's how it works basically. And you've got like it, depending on what you attack, what other, uh, I think, what are they called again? I think it's like legions or something. Basically, if you attack a small group in mm -hmm. their army. Mm -hmm. It's either like called deadlock or interference or raid lock, some shit like that. Yeah. But different like engagements do different things. Oh, you see that? Yeah, you fucking jumped. I jumped off in the cutscene and it worked. That was awesome. I'm dead, like, but it was awesome. <laughs> Out cold completely. Oh, this game is ace, holy shit. Right. Oh god. Easy, easy! Oh god, that's the wrong button. Right. Through here? This is like the beginning of the thing. Is he just gonna fucking smash the shit out of that wall now? Maybe. I don't know. I think he is. Climb up there. Not that that's, one. That's where. I'm... Oh no, I don't think you do. You go back in there. Go back in there. Okay. Because I think you've got. Uh, this is the point where you can knock his armour off. Like you get him to attack something. Mm. Oh God, oh, Jesus mate. Christ! Hello! In your face! Oh God! Oh God! That the bang outside added to the thing. Oh God! I've shit myself! I've absolutely just shit my pants. Really? Yeah. Can we get some wet wipes? No, I'm fine. I'll get used to it. It's squelchy. I like it. Oh. Feel good. I think I need to what? attack this. There's a full one in the thing. I think that's it, actually. I need to get back down there. No, attack him. Get him, like, antagonise him. Right. Oh, Christ almighty. Mate. That's definitely what I need to do, though. Yeah, the entire thing collapses on him. Yeah. 
<clears throat> Put himself. I heard that. Yeah. Delicious. There we go. <coughs> oh. What? Ah. Dead. One's like, oh, because oh, the, the fucking Congress just fallen right behind him. <laughs> <coughs> oh, his little face. He's ever so slightly shit himself. Yeah. Did a little poo. Not so big that you'd be impressed by it, but <laughs> not too small that you'd be, well, that's pathetic. What am I doing? Why am I even doing that? Where are you going? I don't know. Come on. Oh god, camera please. Oh, camera. Quickly! Camera, please. Camera, please. There we go. Oh, delicious. I'm inside. <laughs> hey! Release! Oh god, he's off. He's leading me into the... Yeah. Oh god. He's freaking out. He is freaking out. Man, I'm so glad we've got those... Um, all them lizards now. So For all that extra grip. Yeah. Yeah, mate. Da -da. Da -da. Oh Christ, he's literally, literally shaking you off. Yeah. No chance. Has he jumped across already? Yeah, yeah. Come on, douche noggle. This way. Come on. Ow. So he can't really do it very well anymore, can he? Because he's, he's got, not got all the armor on. Nice. I'm just going to get off. I'm just gonna run around again. No, keep it. Keep him there. No, I mean, like, just get off and get him to do that again, because otherwise, I'm just gonna run around like a prick. Yeah, yeah. Come on. <sighs> nice. Oh, Christ. Doing it. Nah, I fucked it. Oh, holy shit, that was a jump. I've done it. Mastered it. Oh! <laughs> oh, that was awkward. It's fine, we're fine. Ragdoll. Uh, ah, around the shoulder blade. I'm oh, sad. Oh, it's oh. okay, big fella. Oh! Ah! <laughs> and thus ended Wanda's journey. Oh. Trapped underneath a dying colossus until he starved to death. His girlfriend decomposing slowly inside of the temple. <laughs> for a dark for a minute. Jesus. I want to go on tangents, okay? Yeah, I can tell. <laughs>